It was nice to have the office to myself. I got so much done. I can't go to jail for chopping off his arm. There's just no way. I saved his life. He would have turned into a zombie if I didn't chop his arm off. Okay, sure. Did I inadvertently take some pleasure in the fact that it took me two times to chop off his arm? Yes, I did. Call me whatever you want. Whatever adjective in the dictionary you want to call me, call me that. But hey, he's boning my ex and I can't help but get a little upset and that action is satisfying. But I saved his life. I just wish that we kept his arm as evidence to prove that a zombie had been him, but Darren had to throw it in the river because he wouldn't stop puking. It's his fault if we go to jail. Jared has done some awful things. Terrible things. Like, oh, there was that time he tried to get his donation back from the Cancer Research Foundation. Or that time he faked a heart attack so he didn't have to buy Girl Guide cookies. So, obviously, I had my suspicions. But the way he stepped up and saved Dax and Madonna's lives, and all of our lives, made me look at him in a whole new light. Oh, Jared, if you're watching, that does not mean that I want to get back together. Or that I'm talking to you. I'm not. This is still your fault. I don't think Jared did it on purpose. No way. He's not that kind of person. I believe in people a little bit more than that. But even if he did, I, I, I forgive him. You know? I mean, he lost Sarah. God. I couldn't even imagine that. She's so... She's so great. You know? Her eyes are like the ocean. You just want to swim in them and surf in them and boogie board and snorkel in them and go fishing, maybe go on a sunset cruise. Anyways, get lost in them. As you can see, I <laughs> just got lost in thought. So anyways, if I, if I lost her, I don't know what I would do. I mean, I wouldn't physically assault someone or throw them in front of a murderous zombie or anything, but I might think about it, fantasize about it. Okay, get, get real close in on that. Take a look. Okay, I've had this weird toe fungus ever since we got back from the woods. And uh, I'm starting to worry, if I can be honest with you, because, uh, well, um, I know she said it was from the fish, but I'm, I'm a little worried that uh, since it's not going away, I might have caught the infection. The virus, it might be in me. I might turn. I gotta cut my toe off. Gotta cut my toe off. Okay, I'm getting a little nervous about Darren. Okay, like, he's always wanting to kill things. I mean, he's the one who initiated the, the killing of, of Farmer Hank, and, 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 and he really wanted to kill the zombie woman. I mean, before we even knew if she was an actual zombie or not. Yes, I understand that she did try to eat us, but is that really an actual way of saying that somebody's a zombie? I mean, I've seen some really, really freaky shit with people with food poisoning. I mean, it can go sideways in a hurry. I mean, this one time I had some bad fish. You didn't want to be around me. Ho, oh, oh. ho. Right, imagine my urinary action, but coming out the back. Not pretty. I am Dax, I'm the one arm man. I am Dax, I'm the one arm man. I loved a girl. I did so many things. Now I can only do half.
top of them. 